I might wipe though, low key, I might wipe. This boss is like 50 50 clear. I might wipe though. No way. Fuck my life. Feel the terror. Oh my god, my dark side. No use. Oh my god. What the fuck? Oh, the touch, the touch damage, the touch, uh, touch iframe. W. Dude, stop distracting me. Stop, 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 stop. Oh my, where's my dark sight? Dude, you guys are distracting me because of the stupid bot. I'm like, what's going on? Ow, 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 And now, you're rich. Feel the terror. Oh my god. No use. 
Oh my, nor. Dark side cheating, dude. You guys are so quick to like. Dude, you guys actually have no brain. Swear to God, you all think dark sides are actually way better than it really is. Obviously, it helps, but y'all don't know how much harder it is to get your burst off using last resort, bro. Y'all really don't know how much harder it is. Like, it is so much harder with last resort. Like, don't even like, don't even try it, bro. Like, don't, like, y'all really don't even know, bro. It is so much harder with Last Resort, bro. That shit, like, anything just insta-kills you. Yeah. Oh my god, dude, I'm actually gonna wipe low-key. Oh my god, no! Dude, I'm gonna wipe? I'm gonna wipe. You guys broke me out of focus. Dude, I'm actually gonna wipe. This is bad, dude. I'm gonna wipe it like no HP left. Dude, this is crazy. Look at this, dude. You guys keep distracting me, bro. You know I'm easily distracted. Come on, guys. I just need to survive for 30 seconds and I'm good. That's it. Now it's my turn. No, this share the wealth. Oh my god. This is so stupid, bro. This is actually so stupid. Alright, please give me CFP. Begging. I'm cursed. Idea. Oh shit. Oh shit. Dude. Okay. This might be a bad idea. This is really stupid, by the way. 
it's pretty scuffed. Like, it works well right now, but I don't think it'll stay working well. Let's just say that. <laughs> yeah, this is a bad idea. <laughs> this is a bad idea. I need to think of something else or return it. But I'm too lazy to return things, bro. I hate returning shit because I'm lazy. I attached it to my uh, monitor arm, bro. Look at this. I attached it to the monitor arm itself. And it goes up. Kind of big brain. Yeah, but now my issue is... My issue is it's too tall now. It's too high up. It needs to be like... Like right in the middle. It's so annoying. Now it's too high up. Also, now my monitor arm is like sagging. Because there's too much weight on it, probably. Yeah, so now I need a different solution. It's too high up now. This camera is really nice, though. I think my lighting is way better now, right? I'm pretty sure it's like way better now. But it's too high up now. What does it mean for me as a casual in game, early game, 13K Dawn Warrior Android Cap? It's just a game in a dead genre. It's not like it matters. Hello. You want Lucid? I do, I do, I do, I do. Oh, that's a good way to start things off. It's actually a great way to start things off, as a matter of fact. Loki, this conversation got my ball now up. Yo, Loki. Loki. You know what they say. No, what was it called? No publicity is bad publicity or whatever. There you go, bro. Maple's up. <laughs> Dude, the amount of assumptions people make is crazy, though. Like, it is insane. Like, even people in my own guild were like, bro, they're nerfing Reboot. And I'm like, I'll, I, I, I message, I replied to someone, I'm just like, I, I read through everything. They, like, they didn't say that. They didn't say they're nerfing Reboot, though. And then they're just like, oh, I'm just speculating. I'm like, bro, why would you say that? But honestly, Tubes, I forgot how to spell your IGN. That's why. So I was just like, fuck it. Said, so you're not even Korean? Yeah, because I have to be Korean to understand them. True. They literally said they aren't doing anything. Yeah, literally. Like, nothing changes. You know what I mean? Literally, nothing changes. Like, if you're a reboot player, nothing changes. If anything, out of all of this, like, wonky, he seems pretty, like, depressed about it. Hopefully, he realizes and gives us good change. That's it. Like, you know what I mean? Like... Bro, oh my god, bro. I feel like I'm in deja vu. Like, every single time, there's some sort of change. Whether it's, like, fucking totems being removed or something, bro. Like, every single time, there's some sort of change. It's always met with so many assumptions and so much negativity and so much dooming. Like, it's just how it is. And then every single time, you just wait and see what happens. And it's usually fine. Like, usually fine. Like, obviously, sometimes... um, Obviously, sometimes they fuck up. Like, bad, or it's, like, really miserable. Like, obviously. Like, everybody, everybody does, right? But usually, it's fine. You know what I mean? Like, you just gotta wait and see. That's, like, that's just how it is, bro. Just wait and see. Literally, just wait, and then we'll see what happens. It's gonna be actually zero fucking IQ. They can't adapt or change or how many good allocate brain around humans. Yeah, I'm telling you. Like, I was, I was legit ranting about this last night. This game breeds miserable people. Hi, Kobe. What's up? How are you? Like, it just breeds miserable people. Like, there's so, there's just so much dooming going on right now. And I get it. Like, I get Nexon fucks up all the time. But we just got to wait and see. Like, I just hate this whole assumptions thing, bro. Like, just, just wait and see. Like, just chill. Just chill. Literally nothing happened. You know what I mean? Like, literally, like, nothing happened yet. And people also got to rem remind themselves that, like, this is a KMS issue. You know what I mean? Like... People always like to think like, but GMS, but GMS. It's like, to be honest, you, like you got to get real here. Like this is a KMS issue. They're going to handle it. We're just going to get like the crumbs along the way. Like that's just what happens. That's just how it is. They do this every time and it never is the bad outcome they assume. Yeah, people always assume the worst. Like it could get worse, but people always assume like way worse. You know, the biggest I'm one crazy thing genre design is kind of crazy, crazy. I agree. I agree. I was saying this, uh, saying this earlier this morning. Like I agree him saying that like, 
it's just, it's a dying genre anyways is really fucking stupid like that is not a good thing to say especially as the director of the game like you're one of the faces of the biggest mmorpgs in the world and you're saying that like you don't even believe in the genre or your own game like really but at the same time you got to understand that like he was probably like under so much pressure and said something stupid in the heat of the moment and he took a break and collected himself and apologized you know what i mean i'm not gonna like crucify him over making a stupid ass like comment you know what i mean like like people say shit sometimes it's just how it is you know what i mean it's just how it is like people fuck up they get emotional they say something stupid and then and then they realize like oh shit i shouldn't have said that i will i mean that's fine you can do what you want i won't though so he wasn't prepared for chat he took like five minute pauses yeah i mean okay the thing is like i'm not trying to like dick ride nexon here like i will shit on nexon all the time but at the same time like you gotta see it from his per perspective as well like he probably planned this whole thing to talk about culling and stuff like that in the thespia and then he's just getting harassed by chat all the time and he's not a fucking like streamer for example where like you just get harassed all day every day and you're just used to it and you get called ugly indian fat stupid racist ugly fat um like indian all day like he he's not that it's just like you just he probably just like what the fuck you know what i mean and just like was like hurt you know what i mean and said something crazy like i agree what he said was stupid like i agree what he said was like really really fucking dumb like really dumb like he he really like dropped the ball with his comments yeah exactly kobe this is what i mean bro like, kobe just harasses me bro dude like he he said like stupid shit i completely agree but like should you really like crucify somebody just because he said something like in the heat of the moment like like he he apologized and and wants to get it right so we're just gonna we're just gonna wait and see what happens what it, like if he if he apologized after what he said and then he still like fucks us over then it's like oh my god okay like this guy's really like a, an asshole like this guy's really like fucked up but like we just gotta wait and see you know what i mean hopefully you know he he really understands the weight of the people's unhappiness and can implement something that makes people happy you know what i mean like we just gotta wait and see but i'm definitely not gonna go around assuming that the game's dead and it's over like like that like nah we're just gonna wait and see what happens like a pootie pie on the original no that's different that's completely different <laughs> that's completely different that's different that's like, bro, that's, that's, yo, imagine Walkie said some shit like that out of nowhere, bro. Oh my God. That'd be, that, that'd be a whole different thing, bro. Oh my God. People were so hurt that I was calling the server dog. They took it as if I was calling them dog. They didn't know that you were the server, bro. The server itself is dog. Like ask any end, end game, like reg server player. Like it's just facts. Like ever since reboot got the FD changed, like, like reboot's just been so on the up it's crazy them dogs are players who are gonna fund reboot <laughs> uh, can't believe dookie's calling me a dog yeah true i need sound am i dead oh, yeah i am i was like this is block this was blocking it so i'm like wait did i die you start stream 15 minutes before class my bad bro i should have i forgot that the world revolves around you my bad bro i don't know like Jake and Joe are, like a lot of other people are, like I'm just gonna look at it, optimistic mindset. And you could call me delusional, you could spit all these like instances in my face. Trust me, I've been playing this game since reboot release. And like, yes, I understand how much Nexon fucks over people here and there, like I get it. But I'm still gonna be optimistic about it, regardless. You know what I mean? Like I've been through fucking everything and I'm still gonna be optimistic on this game. I always was a big advocate for private island owner 17 helicopter purchaser server until Reboot got the FT change. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Private island owner 17 helicopter purchaser server. Yeah, true. They won after that. Yeah, like, like I, uh, I was endgame on Reboot before the FD change, right? So like I, I like, and I had friends in in in, in reg server that. We're also like, you know, pushing boundaries and stuff like that. And when I would look at their server, I, I like, I honestly understood like, yeah, it's a different game and I can see how it's like fun. You know what I mean? Like, it, like the merching people have shown me, um, like I remember when tire belt became irrelevant and like the amount of effects that had on the game and stuff like that. And I was just like, okay, like, you know, this, this isn't that bad. Like I can understand how people play reg server. Like I get it. 
But I'm telling you, that moment when Reboot got the FD change, I remember that exact day. I was like, I was like, this is crazy. Like the gap between Reboot and Reg Server is so small now. Why would anybody play Reg Server anymore? Because th there was an argument to be made for Reg Server. It's just like, oh, if you want to be as strong as possible. And there was a big difference in gap between Reg and Reboot. Like if you just look at the liberation time. Fucking Bane and, and Barra lived, like, again, years before anybody else. Same with Deathstroke. Like, Deathstroke lived his Hayato years before I lived my Hayato. It's like, yeah, they were so far ahead. Like, if you want the cutting edge, you want to be up to date on everything, you play it on regular server. But nowadays, bro, compare the, the Kalos clear time. Barra clears Kalos, what, like, two, three weeks ago or something like that? And Reboot clears Kalos, like, this week. Like, this previous week. It's, like, only a two-week gap. It's just, like bruh and the amount of money spent like the amount of difference is like fucking hundreds of thousands of dollars it's like bro like ever since that fd patch hit it was over bro like it, it was done like it was just completely done i just looked at i compared the dojo times oh my god i remember the hyatos because i used to be so active in the hyato discord i remember when the fd patch hit and i cleared floor 70 on my hyato and all these other hyatos that were like 80k stat or just like that just like bro what they're just like bro what like all of a sudden like you just clear the same dojo as me like it was just insane like it was just insane positive equals positive community as a streamer and creator, if you are negative the community will be negative as well positive equals positive community at least seven direction i completely agree i completely agree i completely agree i think me i think like i feel like we're in like kind of like a new era of like maple streamers there's a lot of like, new streamers popping up and i think we need to change the mindset like 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 i've been saying like i've been playing for so long and like streamers like on this game like like i don't know maybe i th maybe it's partly because the streamers fault but there's just the, the this game has such a like doom mentality in gms like it, it really is like it needs to change speaking of like bossing and stuff i kind of wish Kong required more force with less hp on the boss i get time gate bad and stuff but p1 has almost 2x hp of kalos wow what the hell i didn't even know that what the fuck Oh my god, that's actually that's actually crazy. Bro, the fact that it's 285 is also insane. Like, I, I get it. It makes sense because Kalos is 280, Saren's 275. So naturally, Kalos 285. But like, bro, five levels isn't the same. Five levels is not five levels. Like, you know what I mean? Like, 280 to 285 is not the same as 275 to 280. Like, it's such a big difference. Imagine the next boss is 290. Like, bro, like it's actually impossible to reach these levels. It takes so long. It takes so long. Yeah, like, plus... They're just like, oh, plus five. Plus five. Plus five. It's like, bro, plus five is, is so massive. Why can't they do, like, again, 283 or something? Like, why? Like, 285? Dude, you know minimum endgame level is going to be 286 now, right? Because you, you need to use, like, your, your relative links. You want a little bit of FDE boost. Like, 286 is going to be... Like, I swear, like, people in my guild are already, like... Are already saying like oh i'm training to 290 like people in my guild they're already they're like oh like good thing i started training to 290 you know what i mean can i work same level wait does it oh my god i actually never knew that what the fuck not me and you yeah not me and you uh no. you know no shot no shot do we not want this though yeah i mean there's there's pros and cons but it's just crazy though like we need we need some buff in exp2 because it's like there's no way they could expect us to train to 290 and then pass 290 just in odium right like that's that's what too slow like that is too slow it's way too slow like there's no way even right now training to 290 in odium is pretty bad like it's really slow i think mai was saying she gets like maybe one percent and uh a whap at 285 bro like what and that's at that's at like the the 300 sack maps you know what i mean like that's at the the highest like map like that's crazy uh so i don't even want him to not yeah there's there's a bunch of people over 290 by now um so it's like somewhat confirmed from here on out newly released end game bosses will no longer be able to be bound oh interesting really like, can Kaling not be bound or something? Mia say that she doesn't play anymore. I thought I didn't say Mia. What are you talking about? Uh, level three hundred burning. Oh. 
Very likely we'll be fighting apostles up to Darmar moving forward. Yeah, that makes sense. I think a lot of people are assuming um, every new apostle we'll be getting is like, it's going to be 285, 290, 295, and so on. I feel like they're... I feel like they're gonna have multiple boss releases in one. Like, let's just say hypothetically, the next boss release is level 290. They'll release like two two bosses instead of just one. Because aren't there like a bunch of apostles? Like, there's not enough space in between the levels. Did you change anything to Oz Rings? No. Do you think level cap will exceed 300? Of course, of course. At some point it will. Yeah, of course. Bro, and people say Adele's don't have iframes, bro. It would say Adele doesn't have iframes, by the way. Wait, why is G4 at three lives, bro? Oh. Anyways. Yeah, no, it'll definitely go past 300. That's just how it is. Like, it's going to fucking reach probably, like, level 1,000 one day. That's just literally how it is. But my little headcanon is I think they're going to completely revamp the game after 300. Like, I think they're going to do, like, something insane. Like, a huge, complete overhaul of the game. Where they're going to, like, change so much. Like, I think after 300, they're going to, like... It's going to be, like, a whole new page in Maple history. Like, it's going to be a completely different, like, upgrading system. And, like... EXP curve like people are gonna hit 250 like it's level 200 you know what I mean like that's that's what I think they're gonna do after after 300 I think they will ever do a level squish and mm, probably not it's probably just gonna keep going up and up and up and up reasonable EXP for bossing I mean maybe Found hello super giga fams no they're not gonna do fams Hit cap increase when? Well, 150 bills is pretty good for now. Like, people aren't really capping that much. Like, you can cap, but it's not like it's, like, common. Like, when it was 10 bill. They'll re they'll increase the cap eventually. But, like, probably not anytime soon. We had 10 bill cap for so long. For so long, dude. For so long. Just to fuck everybody else up. Remember 50 mil cap. Yeah. You buy all the black frames from event shop? Oh no, I'm just buying the sacred force. Dude. <laughs> Not to call out Mr. Tweet or anything, but he said something pretty funny today that just made me laugh. And I'm just like, no way people are really thinking like this. He was just asking like... <laughs> he asked two questions today that just made me laugh. One of them was like... It was like, okay, so how does this whole controversy change, like, my progression? It's like, bro, nothing happened. What do you mean? <laughs> nothing happened, bro. And then the second thing... The, set the, the second thing was, does KMS use Reddit? I was like, bro, what? <laughs> Just made me laugh, bro. Level 300 is a rebirth system? It may be. The yeah, iframe the bubble happens to the rest. How do you fuck him up? I think it gets transferred to someone. I think. Not 100% sure though. That's what people keep telling me though. When I, I, I'm pretty sure it doesn't work that way. But everybody keeps telling me, why are you iframing the bomb, bro? You're fucking up your party. So now they've like ga gaslit me into thinking that way. Unless it really does work that way. Please, please, please. Oh my god, you hate me. You hate me. She skills? I don't have any on this character. Did he? He was at in Lotus Lobby? Dude's following me, all good, that's fine. Can't do anything to me in Lotus.
that's fine, bro. Like, you can follow me all you want. All good. He loves you? Yeah, I know. He's in chat. I mean, the thing is, like, when you cast a streamer, like, it's like... Like, if you're bored, like, you always win, you know what I mean? Like, it's, um... You always get attention out of it, right? Also, can I use it a boss move? It's really good, actually. Yeah, I like it a lot. So One Piece class, you're low key, yeah. What the fuck? I'm typing in chat. Oh shit! No wonder my skills weren't going up. This character's 13k. Pretty, pretty fast. Uh, it's not max nodes, but they're pretty decently leveled. Fems? Yeah, it's like super, super, super rare. Uh, my K flame is more rare, for sure. Go in the air, please. No, not that one. He went up there and the other one. Okay. Damien also fam? Uh, I've never seen a Damien fam. A lot of people seem to have path marks. Pop fans? Yeah, I've seen those too. Wait. Oh my god, I don't have... Oh, I didn't have, I didn't have Buckshot on. Wow, what the hell? I must have turned it off on accident. Okay. 
champions, come out! Hey, where are you going? Hey, where are you going? Your progression video, great video. Is it a bad idea to use Monster Park? Can it, uh, uh, the drop rate doesn't work on nodes and stuff like that. It only works on like fucking pencil ear and shit, like equip drops. So I would not recommend it for training gear. No. It's good to have to kill bosses, like in loot rooms, but for training gear, no, I don't recommend it. Dude, CM is actually so good in Damien, it's crazy. You think you'll get more from KMS Reboot players coming to watch you now that they found out Reboot's better than Reg? Uh, maybe. I'm not sure. Maybe a few. Hello KMS players, yeah, hello. What's up? I shall advertise Dookie the Greens. Dude, do it, for real. Tell them, tell them number one GMS player. Easy, bro, CM is Pog. For, for Damien, like it's like really good. Guaranteed bullets. You, you think KMS can recover? Of course, of course. Bro, uh, you think KMS can cover? Of course, can recover. Of course it can. Of course it can. What do you mean? Uh, of course, uh, dude. Uh, nothing. Literally nothing was worse than the stupid flame compensation bullshit with the inner and the flames. And all this stuff. Literally nothing was worse. And it recovered. Like, literally nothing was worse than that. Like, oh my god. That was so bad, bro. People were gonna, like, destroy HQ, bro. Like, they were gonna... I probably shouldn't say anything, but... Yeah. That event was great. It wasn't an event, though. <laughs> it wasn't an event. How did you feel when you heard about that? Dude, I was mind blown when that happened. I was mind blown. I was already endgame at that time. I finished all my gear and everything. So like, I was mind blown when I found that. When I found out that the last like, however long I was playing, like two and a half years was just bullshit, bro. All of the money I spent on flames, bro, I got 36,000 points back. You know how many, you know how much money that is in flames? Do you realize how much money that is in flames, bro? Me too, Kobe, to be honest with you. Me too. Literally, I can start a new account. I'm a roach. I actually can't die. Bro. Like, oh my god. When you realize that all the rumors were true, because the thing is, it wasn't like a complete smack in the face. Like, okay, okay, it was like a smack in the face, but we theorized that flames were rigged. People were saying it as a joke, but then people started realizing that, like, why does every single good flame have like jump on it why or like speed or like like we just like we're just like why is that a thing bro like why like it doesn't make any sense they're just like have you ever noticed that and they're like yeah and then it turns out that it was actually rigged the whole time 
and it was insane to just find out that you were playing a broken system the whole time like you were just getting scammed from day one and you, and you never knew and you thought it was legit it was so stupid bro yeah no it was never fair like the whole competition it, it, it'll never be fair never like it, it was like a it, it was nothing not like not even close to like how much time I wasted like n nothing bro or trip to Korea I'm gonna drive on the water <laughs> yeah true feed your snail I'm crying IRL right, I'm just gonna turn it off but yeah basically what happened in Korea just to summarize um, as you may or may not know a lot of the K KMS uh, shit server players are realizing that reboot is pog long story short they they want you know their shit server to be better because reboots pog due to a bunch of a bunch of reasons why i'm not gonna get into the details of why their shit server is shit but um just know that they're not happy with it and they want nexon to do something about it nexon basically replied and said um you guys are being babies you're overreacting like chill out it's not that deep this is this is a dying genre this is a dying genre nobody plays mmorpgs anymore so why are you taking it so seriously like they literally like said that you know what i mean like they literally said that like they're just like it doesn't matter bro like what the fuck are you talking about it doesn't need any change and then they freaked the fuck out that they said that and then wonky was like um I forgot he said some other bullshit too that was dumb as hell to be honest with you but then he realized um he realized that what he was saying was like really like uncalled for and apologized and like really apologized and he's just like nah my bad like i shouldn't have said that and like i, I will make the game better like don't worry but um but uh basically uh because wonky said that it triggered like a mass like freak out in the kms uh, community where people are selling their gear they're quitting they're they're quitting selling their gear moving to reboot like oh that's what it was Trohi. that's what it was that's why i forgot so wonky when he was like defending himself he brought up he's like he's like oh my god like you guys he basically he was telling us that we're ungrateful basically he's like well, you're so ungrateful he didn't say he's ungrateful but what he said is insinuating that we're we're ungrateful because he's like oh i could have made it he's like oh i could have made it that Upgrading your your symbol levels um, and upgrading your node levels could have costed maple points, and you would have had to spend money to do it. But I didn't do it anyways. I'm helping you guys out. I I, I made it so that you guys could only spend meso instead of actual maple points. And people freaked out that he said that. It's like, yo, bro, what? You're doing the bare minimum. You like, bro, what? Are you stupid? And then he he apologized. He was just like, oh my god, like I got emotional, blah blah blah, like. Like, I was just frustrated. He didn't know how to... He wasn't ready for the whole live stream and stuff like that. So he apologized and um, he regretted what he's saying. And he's going to... He said he's going to make the game better. We don't know how. We have to wait and see. Um, but yeah, him doing that really caused people to freak out. Like, selling their gear, quitting to reboot, quitting the game entirely, all that stuff. So now, um, because of that happened... Um, People are really dooming hard. Like, people are really, like, freaking out. Especially over here. Like, over here as well. Like, people are really freaking out. They're just like, it's over. GMS is done too. Like, it's done. We're quitting. Like, Nexon. Like, it's over, bro. Like. <sighs> so, I'm just trying to have, like, an optimistic outlook. Like, yeah, he said some stupid shit. But, like, you know. You know, people say dumb things when they're under a lot of pressure sometimes. They make mistakes. And, um. Uh, we just gotta wait and see how he recovers. It's, um. Uh, you know those uh that saying which is like never never it's like it's like you don't want to like judge okay like sometimes you should judge people or, or what's the fucking phrase it's like judge a person by how they recover not how they fucked up or something like that it's like it's like a, man, a man's worth is based off of how he like bounces back so, some shit like that i forgot what it was but it, it's basically that like you know just chill until we see what he actually does you know what i mean like he might recover from this like really pog and we don't know right like anyways i'll see you guys tomorrow thank you guys so much for watching me i do appreciate that a lot follow if you haven't already and then i'll see you guys tomorrow